Welcome Leo to your weekly reading. This is for the 30th of September to the 7th of October. We are going to go ahead and see all the possible energies and messages coming through for you for this week. Leo, I'm going to start off by looking at the first row as the possible energy beginning the week. The second row is going to be the area you should focus on. The third row are your possible challenges, if any. The fourth row are messages and advice from spirit. And finally, the fifth row is the possible outcome of the week. Leo, this is a collective reading, so take what resonates and leave the rest. I'm going to start off over here with King of Pentacles, and we're looking at the possible energy beginning the week. And I'm just going to get your clarifier. So we want to see what King of Pentacles is for Leo, please. The Ace of Pentacles. Leo, at the beginning of the week, there is somebody coming through presenting as king of pentacles now this could be a masculine or feminine it is the energy of king of pentacles i am speaking about now king of pentacles is usually somebody who is very well established they understand the world of money and finance they're grounded solid and stable and i feel whoever this particular person is they are coming in my dear leos with our ace of pentacles energy They've got an offer or an opportunity for you. Something, my dear Leos, that is new. It might be unexpected or it could be something you've been working towards. But they're going to offer you something, Leo, that I feel is going to be very good for you to consider. As you see, our king is holding the pentacle there and we're seeing the pentacle repeat again. Ace of Pentacles is the hand of God coming through with a pentacle. So we know that whatever this is for you, it is blessed by spirit. Whatever this is for you, Leo, it has an opportunity of taking you out of an existing situation or relationship and moving you down a new road into something new. Leo, this could be a job offer. This could be a relocation or a move. This could be the opportunity of getting a promotion or an increase. This could be somebody coming in, my dear Leos, and offering you a business opportunity. So as you can see, it's going to be very different for everybody. But we do see that whatever King of Pentacles is coming in with, Leo, there's something here that's going to be worthwhile considering. Now let us see what Page of Pentacles is all about that is sitting in the area you should focus on. So we want to see now what Page of Pentacles is for Leo, please. The Queen of Cups. Leo, you are coming through under this message as Queen of Cups. Once again, it does not matter if you are masculine or feminine. It is the energy of Queen of Cups I am speaking about. You are being asked, my dearest Leos, to consider the pentacle. Here it is repeating again. Because Page of Pentacles lets us know that this, my dear Leo, is something new for you. Something that's going to allow you to initiate or begin something. But because we are seeing our pentacle now coming through three times, we now have a firm understanding. There is something here. As you can see, our Queen of Cups is facing the Ace of Pentacles. Leo, whether this has to do with a relationship or whether it has to do with your abundance and your money and your finances, what I am seeing for you is that this particular opportunity is going to be very good for you on very many levels. It's not just about getting a great job with great pay. If it is a job, it's going to be a job that fulfills you, my dear Leo. It's going to be somewhere where you can grow and expand. You will learn and develop. 
it'll have deeper meaning for you than just monetary gain. So for example, my dear Leo's King of Pentacles could be a very close friend who comes in and suggests that together you begin something on the side, doing something that you both love. So for example, say you both love designing and creating jewellery and you have a very special and unique style of doing it. And your friend suggests that you form a little business and you start selling your jewellery online. This Ace of Pentacles has potential now of not only increasing your earnings every month, but working with King of Pentacles, you will learn a lot about yourself. You'll learn a lot about King of Pentacles. You will learn what it takes to be in business, how to deal with clients and how to deal with customers. And there's also that element of deep satisfaction and that element of reward when you see people loving your product, buying it and wearing it. So we see that there is wonderful potential here for you in however it comes up for you, my dear Leos. Let us move on now and see what Eight of Cups is all about that is sitting in possible challenges. So we want to see what Eight of Cups is for Leo, please. The Knight of Pentacles. My dear Leos, I don't feel that what I am seeing here is a big challenge and what I'm seeing is not going to resonate with everybody. But for some of my Leos, this pentacle that is being offered, as I mentioned, is going to enable you to move out of one situation and move into another situation. Now, some of my Leos are just going to have a hard time leaving an existing situation. And my dearest Leos, it's completely understandable. If you are happy in your job, you love your colleagues and you love your boss, and you get a promotion, and your promotion now calls for you to leave your colleagues and your boss, there is going to be an element of sadness about leaving them behind. But I do not feel that this will hold you back, because with Knight of Pentacles coming out, Leo, you will understand that you are moving on to something solid, something that you are able now to build a solid new foundation for yourself that is going to enhance your life in some way. So as I mentioned, I do not feel that this is a big challenge. It's about saying goodbye to something we enjoyed or cared about as we move on and grow. So this is what we are seeing as a possible challenge. Now let us see what Knight of Wands is for you that is sitting in messages and advice from Spirit. So we want to see what our Knight of Wands is for Leo, please. The Seven of Pentacles. Neo Spirit is coming through and with Seven of Pentacles that this could be quite a big jump for some of my Leos and that if you need to take time to sit with it, think about it, absorb what it means for you, take the time you need. You do not have to feel rushed or pressurized. You know, Leo, whenever we make a big decision, no matter how wonderful it sounds, it's actually always a good idea just to pull back, even if it's just for a few days, just to let that decision integrate. You know, when we initially hear good and wonderful news, we immediately want to say, yes, yes, yes. And then afterwards, all these other things start coming up. What will it mean when I move in with my significant other? I now have to give notice on my apartment. What will I do with all my stuff? Am I ready to move in? Do I like the neighborhood my significant other is living in? So Spirit wants you to take the time to go through everything and raise any questions that you might have so you don't feel pressurized or have any doubts. With that, Spirit is confirming that this pentacle, my dearest Leos, is going to enable you in some way 
to express yourself from a creative point of view. You're going to be able to do things, go places and experience things that perhaps was not available and possible before. So the Knight of Wands coming in, Spirit is saying, once you decide that this is for you and you're all in, my dear Leos, you can anticipate this to be a very fulfilling experience. Now let us see who or what King of Swords is for you that is sitting in the possible outcome of the week. So we want to see now who or what King of Swords is for Leo, please. The Fool. Leo, you are coming through at the end of the week, presenting as King of Swords. Once again, it does not matter if you're masculine or feminine. It is the energy of King of Swords I am speaking about. We see you being very logical and analytical about what is taking place for you this week. You, my dear Leos, are letting your head rule your heart. You're looking at what this pentacle is from a mental perspective. You're not going to allow your emotions to come in and affect or cloud your judgment anyway. Once you have all the information you need, you know the details, you know the ins and outs of what this Ace of Pentacles is for you, then, my dearest Leos, I do believe you're going to take a leap into a new beginning. I do not feel that this is going to be a risky leap of faith. You are taking a very educated and calculated leap of faith. You know, my dear Leos, after thinking and analysing everything, what you can expect and you're going in smart and well informed. So we see you taking a very strong, confident leap of faith. Right, let's go ahead now and get a message from your guides for the week. So we just want to see now what Leo's guides would like to share, please. Purpose, Master Teacher, number 38. So Leo, the number 38 is your lucky number this week. Any combination or variation of the numbers 3 and 8, please consider very auspicious. Master Teacher wants you to know, my dearest Leos, that this week you are going to find purpose within whatever this Ace of Pentacles represents to you. It's going to give you a new way forward, a new path forward, which we saw over here. And a path, my dear Leos, that's going to fulfill you on many levels. As you can see here, our figure is holding what seems to be a briefcase, which lets us know this is going to be very good for you in terms of your abundance and security. And the flowers here represent your emotional well-being. With the stars coming in, we know, my dear Leos, that this is a blessed path for you. And as you walk along this new road, you're going to discover a lot of new and amazing things. There's a lot here to look forward to. So, that is all I have for you right now. I hope you enjoyed your reading. I wish you the most wonderful week, and I am sending you all so much love.